Welcome to Gradient Flow Snapshot number 44. For those who need to interactively analyze big graph data, GraphScope is a unified distributed graph computing platform from Alibaba. With the GraphScope system architecture, you can interactively analyze big graph data on large clusters at low latency. GraphScope has an easy-to-use Python interface. You can process computation over very large graphs in a Jupyter Notebook. You can try the GraphScope playground directly in your browser in a managed Jupyter Lab session. In GraphScope, a scope is a data flow subgraph. The program uses scope abstraction to support the process of maintaining context information. The source code for GraphScope is available on GitHub. See Gradient Flow newsletter number 29 for more. Batch normalization is a key component of most image classification models, but it is limited by its dependence on the batch size and interactions between samples. DeepMind's new state-of-the-art image recognition models trained without batch normalization are also 8.7 times faster to train. See Gradient Flow newsletter number 29 for more. A new book by New York Times cybersecurity reporter Nicole Perlroth looks at governments using hacking as a weapon of war. A zero day is a software or hardware flaw for which there is no existing patch. According to Perlroth, governments have been buying them and storing them in vaults. We highly recommend the critically acclaimed book, This Is How They Tell Me the World Ends. To learn more, visit gradientflow.com newsletter and subscribe. Thank you.